tell you about the stars in the sky And a girl and a guy And the way they could kiss On a night like this Can I look into your big brown eyes It's a... bigger guy is. You can't find a body, so I don't know if it's down here hiding. I just don't want to disturb. The, but I don't want to pull this one off because there's three more eggs on there. And then over here, nursery number two, look at this little guy. See, put him there. Oh, yeah. And then there's a little teeny one right there. There's a couple more in there. So. That one's so teeny. <laughs> oh my goodness. A new brandy new. <laughs> Okay, so this is all the stuff we brought in behind the shutters before the hurricane or the tropical depression, whatever it is. It's a rainstorm now. It's a rainstorm now. That's the butterfly habitat. Here's an empty patio, pretty much. Here's the hot tub, and we actually chained the cover down. I hope that works, but doesn't look like it's going to get that windy anyway. Anyway, that's what we're doing. Here is our butterfly habitat. We've got a gazillion, well, we have quite a few caterpillars still in here. They're eating us out of house and home. And we have two. One is up in the J shape, which they say means he's going to be like he's getting ready to shed his skin, her skin. Chrysalis is underneath. This one is, where's this one? This one hasn't done the J yet. Spinning the silk to hang from the J. And these guys are still eating. Eating, 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 eating. Let's see. There's, a, there's this guy. Look at their antennas. You can tell how far along they are. This guy's pretty far along. He uses his antenna to feel. That means he's getting close to the end. This guy, where is he? His antenna aren't quite that long. And then we got little ones in here too. And the 
this here was the guy, where is he? It was lost, and I guess he found his way back to the milkweed. He should be about ready. A few that should be about ready. This guy, also maybe a girl, if that line means it, I don't know, I'll have to find out. Yeah. Lots of wiggling antennas here. <laughs> Away. How do they do it? <laughs> okay. Them just munch, 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 munch. Pretty good, huh? You see any more? Nope. I just see mouths going. There's our, I think he's looking for a place to hang. He doesn't fall. He's like, I was going to go hang down there where you put that other guy. family of black belly whistling ducks. Chirp, 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 chirp. Here's our little duckies again. Chirp, 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 chirp. Chirp, 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 chirp. Uh-oh. 
Oh, one's wandering away. Better come back, little ducky. Here it comes. Getting lost. Better hurry up, little ducky. There it goes. Here's our, oops, there they go, our little duckies. Can't see them now. Should be coming in view. There's, there they go. Let me see if I can get down. Oh, my legs hurt to squat. There they go. Mommy, Daddy, and seven little ducklings. Daddy and all the little ducklings. Look how cute they are. Cheek, cheek, cheek. Oh, stop, Charlie. Pulling on the leash. There they go. Okay, so here we are. It's Tuesday. Uh, August 10th? 11th? Yeah, 11th. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten chrysalides in here. I think a couple up there. We have one that failed. The guy did not attach it and it fell. Once it hardens, I'm going to see if I can uh, attach it, but I think it might be lost. Anyway, and we still got more caterpillars, and Doug ran up to Weatherby and bought more. They got a second mortgage to feed these frickin' things. Doug wants to deduct them from our income tax. We got a guy climbing up here. It's hard to see. We got two crowding back there. I'm like, why are you guys so close back there? Stop being so crowded. Anyway. Here we are. That's our first baby, I think. I should have marked when they were. Why these guys over here had to go so close together. Focus. Focus. Wish those guys in the back would move. They're too close. But I guess in Mother Nature they'd be uh, hidden amongst the plants for the lizards to eat them. That's right. So we have two toddlers. Mm -hmm. They're starting to toddle around. Maybe three feet away. So here are the first two hatchlings. Melanie calls them toddlers. They're toddlers now, they're starting to get mobile. <laughs> There we go. Uh, well, here though, the three, three. 
Well, here, so there are three counties. Uh, Hold on a second. I'm going to... Yeah. So this is my first... This is our first batch. <gasps> okay. We're going to let them go. Unzipping the door. Oh my goodness. I know. Okay. Except, you know what? It takes them like four to five weeks to get to be a butterfly. And they live like three weeks. It's like, so they live to, to mate. Okay, that's a boy. See the dots? Well, when he opens, that's a boy. Let's see what this one is. See the dots on the wing? Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, you know, watching these things go through their stages is like watching paint dry, literally. It is hours and hours and hours of nothing, and then they do something. <laughs> so. That's right. Tanya did this with Nolly. How about that? Whoa! <laughs> oh, flew the coop. Yep. Oh, well, there he is. He's up top here. Oh, I can't see him. Come over here. He's on the areca leaf. Here okay, here's our, one of our boys. He just flew the coop or the habitat or the who's gal. Is he still there? It's hard to see him. Yeah, let's let the dogs out before we go. Well, okay. We can stay out here with him. Yeah. I'm going to go get him. Let me see. I'm trying to make sure I... It's hard to see this guy. Zoom in. Huh? Zoom. I, I'm trying to find... I think he left. No, he's still there. Just trying to find him. Yeah, there he is. Can't tell. Can't see him in here. I don't think it's focused. What color is there? A red dot? Yeah. But I think that's the leaf. Mm -hmm. It's having a hard time focusing. See? There's three up top now. Let's see how one guy does. Oh, you hurt yourself, buddy. Go. There he goes. Oh, okay. Off. There goes another one. There goes one. another one. Go too fast. Oh, look at he's up on the thing there. Oh, I think yeah. That's another girl. Yay. I don't know. I think these are ready. This guy doesn't look too ready, huh? Don't leave him in there. This is a boy. There he goes! He was ready! Oh, 
Here we go. <laughs> and they're off. Yay. Yeah. You might wake up some morning to the sound of something moving past your window in the wind. And if you're quick enough to rise, you'll catch the fleeting glimpse of someone's fading shadow. Out on the new horizon, you may see the floating motion of a distant pair of wings. And if the sleep has left your ears, you might hear footsteps running through an open meadow. Don't be concerned, it will not harm you. It's only me pursuing something I'm not sure of. Across my dreams, with nets of wonder, I chase the bright, elusive butterfly of love. You might have heard my footsteps echo softly in the distance through the canyons of your mind. I might have even called your name as I ran searching after something to believe in. You might have seen me running through the long abandoned ruins of the dreams you left behind. There that glided past you Followed close by heavy breathing Don't be concerned It will not harm you It's only me pursuing something I'm not sure of Across my dreams With nets of wonder I chase the bright elusive butterfly of love Across my dreams with nets of wonder, I chase the bright elusive 